professional as a practice discipline. Influencing nursing practice will be addressed with the inclusion of both nursing and non-nursing theories. Theories related to the development of the therapeutic relationship of nursing metaparadigm, the person, health, environment, and nursing. Major and roles of the future nurses by exploring concept and underlying nursing problems. So, what are we waiting for? Let's start! The professional nursing roles. We all know that there are many opportunities to shape the future of the nursing profession and nursing practice since the nurses improve the quality of the lives of their clients, community, and society. Nurses provide the care for the sick, such as primary health care, wellness, and self-care. Nurses are expected to perform a variety of roles in health care. First, caregiver. It assists the client's physical, psychological, developmental, cultural, and spiritual needs. It involves a full care to a completely dependent client, partial care for the partially dependent client and supportive educative care in order to attain the highest possible level of health and wellness. Nurse Administrator Nurse manage client care and specific nursing services within a healthcare agency. Position range from middle management such as nurse manager or supervisor to upper management such as associate director or vice president. Case manager, the nurse coordinates the activities of the other healthcare providers in collaboration with the direct care provider. It's a doctorally prepared nurse who investigates problems to improve nursing care, further defines and expands the scope of nursing or validates nursing care practices. Nursing is also an educator. Nurses are responsible in teaching nursing theories, clinical practices, technical skills to prepare the students to take the licensure examinations and to assume the role of nurses. Nurses are also a family educator because they are also responsible to provide their family with the information and the skills that makes them more healthy. Direct care provider. The nurse assists the clients to regain health through healing process. He or she provides a holistic approach to care. Advanced Practice Nurse The nurse has a master's degree in nursing and expertise in a specialized area of practice. They can be clinical nurse, specialist, nurse practitioners, certified nurse midwives, certified registered nurse anesthetist, and others. So, now we are here in the Autonomous oh, okay, Health Clinic so. to interview some of their nurses. So, let's go! Good afternoon po, we are the student nurses of Don Mariano Marcos Memorial State University, College of Community Health and Allied Medical Sciences. So, can we ask your name, ma'am? Uh, I'm Shania Mamunia, and I'm called Minea. I'm Jen. So, here are some questions. For you, what are those professional roles of nurses? Uh, one of the professional roles of uh, runners or nurses is family educator. So, syempre, hindi lang naman pasyente ang concern natin, yung family din. So, syempre, educate natin yung pasyente, din yung family, para aware din sila once makauwi ang pasyente sa bahay, kung ano ang mga management na gagawin sa pasyente, once makauwi na, na-discharge ng pasyente. So, dapat involved siya para siyang ano, multidisciplinary ang dati. So, as a registered nurse, can you tell us a piece of advice that will encourage us to become a professional and effective nurse someday? Uh, personally, sa akin, kaya mga kasi 2007 pa ako graduate, so I've been a nurse for 11 years na. I've been into different institutions na rin. Nakahandle na ako ng maraming iba't maraming iba't ibang klaseng pasyente. So, sa akin lagi, you always listen sa pasyente. Kapag may sinasabi siya sa inyo, huwag yung magbibingi-bingihan tayo na, ayun lang naman yan. Kasi lagi, lagi natin isipin na yung pasyente, hindi siya magpapa-admit nang wala siyang nararamdaman. So, kahit ba fever lang yan, hindi naman nakakamatay na ano, wala siya pakinggan. Siya lang hindi kasi ang nakakaramdam. Hindi, oh, hindi man, lang nakikita man natin na hindi halata oh, sa mukha niya, man, pero man. siya kasi nakakaramdam. Kaya dapat, bigyan mo ng attention. Hindi, nakapatuto tayo mag, ano, maging empath, mag, ano to? Empathy. Empathy. Oo, oh, empathy. Bakit na gusto niyo yung pasyente. 
sa mga pakaramdam ko. Parang ano yun yun siya, mag-establish kayo ng rapport din sa kanya. Tsaka mag-eye to eye contact kayo kasi doon nila nalalaman na may care talaga kayo. Especially din sa medications, even na medications, hindi lang yung magpupush lang kayo ng ID. Hindi oh. nyo sabihin yung uh, action ng gamot kasi may mga pasyente na kung wala rin hindi nila alam pero nag-observe lang nila kayo. So, syempre, gain yun ka. Stay nyo lahat ng gagawin nyo sa pasyente kasi parang respeto nyo yun. Hindi lang yung hiniwin nyo po itong gamot, bigay ko na po itong gamot, sakamis na kayo. So parang medyo off yun sa pasyente. So lahat, explain natin sa pasyente. Kasi karapat ang gila yun. Tapos, ganun na. It's always decent sa gusto ng pasyente. Okay, tapos mahalin natin yung mga pasyente natin. Hindi lang kasi, usually kasi hindi lang sa skills na katita ang pagiging nurse. Kahit anong galing mo, kahit memorize mo yung nanda, yung memes, kahit memorize mo, wala ka namang tuso. Correct. Attitude mo, iba pa. Wala ka rin pa rin ka sa iba. So, ano yan? Simultaneous yan. Magaling ka, skills-wise, dapat may tuso ka rin. At attitude lang ka. Tapos, humble lang ka. Kahit ma-promote kayo from, ano, ba, leader staff to supervisor to manager, humble lang tayo. Kasi, hindi naman tayo magiging ganun. Pula rin sa mga pasyente. So, yun hindi lang ang puso, pero ang dami. Hindi lang naman. Thank you po. So, congrats sa inyo. Thank you po. Good luck sa picture. So now, welcome to the College of Community Health and Allied Medical Sciences. Good morning po. Nandito tayo sa SAS office upang interviewin si Ma'am Jima as chairperson of CJOPS. Regarding po sa nurse educator, a career of nurse educator po. Ma'am, good morning po. Good morning. Can you share us some info regarding your career as a nurse educator? Uh, so, information about uh, my career as a nurse educator. Uh, can you also share please? Uh, habang, no una, medyo mahirap kasi syempre adjustment. Kasi, ang talagang hinuha ko na course is nursing. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, parang sa clinical dapat, clinical setting. Pero dahil pumunta ko sa akadim, kung wala, hindi ko mag-adjust. Lalo na yung mga iba, lalo na yung mga students kasi may iba iba silang personality. Pero, uh, nung una lang naman yung nahirapan ako. Pero nung mga succeeding days and years, kasi 10 years na ako dito sa C-Jumps. Yeah. Uh, Nakapag-adjust na rin ako sa mga iba't ibang behavior ng mga students. And, uh, masaya sa feeling yung ang dami mo nang napag-graduate ng mga students, then pag gumabalik sila, is kilala ka pa rin nila. Yun lang yun naman yung nagpapasaya. O, parang ganda ng feeling na marami kang natulungan. O, tsaka, na-share yung knowledge mo skills sa ibang mga estudyante. Si Mga Ka. Yun lang. Ma'am, what are the potentials and behavior analysts in the potential health? Okay, so behaviors and potential. So, sa tingin ko, kailangan ng passion ang isang nurse educator. Ibig sabihin ng passion is they love what they are doing. Kahit may stress ka pa siguro sa isang bagay o sa trabaho, kung love mo naman ito, hindi yun mag magiging dahilan para mag-quit ka. And, uh, kailangan uh, you encourage your students to do more and to learn more. Kasi sila yung future natin. Kung hindi maganda yung, uh, kung hindi ka passionate sa kanila, hindi mo din sila mamamold as a passionate person. At the same time, kailangan din ng commitment and uh, competency, competent. Okay, so sa commitment, kailangan kahit na uh, over time, eh, kailangan mo pa rin i-share your uh, time sa mga students kasi they need you. Okay, then competent kasi kailangan natin maging competent kasi para tama yung ginagawa natin, tinuturo natin sa mga students kasi Uh, nurse, uh, nursing students in the future, they will become a nurse. And nurse deals with lives of people. So, kung hindi siya competent to do the nursing interventions, syempre, yung mga patients nila, nila 
least pwede silang either mamatay sila or magkaroon ng complication. Uh, dumating na po ba sa point na tayo ang alam mo kasi depende na tayo kasi sa trabaho ng marami kung baka marami may tapakong um, may, may mga times din na gusto ko na rin mag-quit at uh, maghanap ng ibang work. Pero hindi ko naman uh, totally na inayawan. Kasi 10 years na ako dito. So, iniisip ko din kasi yung ibang mga students. Sa kanilang mga umalis ako. Uh, Parang calling na rin. So, yes, I think so. Kasi dito, last na ko. Uh, how to be you po? Uh, I don't want to be Hindi <laughs> ko alam mo paano magiging ako. Pero, yun lang. Uh, binibigay ko lang yung passion ko dun sa work and dedication para sa uh, para sa my students. Yun lang. Wala na nang ikaw. Wala na special. Video. <laughs> Bloopers. <laughs> Bloopers. <laughs> 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 <laughs>